Number 16 is they are not reacting to you. They are reacting to your depression. And this is a big one. I had to realize this so that I could forgive my family. Um, it was so hard for them to be around me being the way I was. And I had to realize, first of all, that I am not depression. I'm Jody. Depression is something I have. It is no part of me. It is no part of my personality. It is not who I am. It is something I have that's very much like a computer virus, that once it's gone away, the whole Jody will still be there, not burdened by this thing anymore. It's not me. It's something I have, and it's something I have that's going to go away. So once I stopped identifying with my depression as a part of me, I could separate their reaction to it as not being directed towards me. My friends and family love me. They think I'm wonderful. Okay, there's some things about me they find annoying, but they're, they're pretty nice to not let me know about it for the most part, because they care about how I feel. But at the time when I was depressed, nobody likes depression. Nobody wants to be with it. They may run away because it's painful. They're not running away from you. It's self-preservation. They're running away from your depression. They may become frustrated and angry. They're not angry at you. They're angry at your depression. This thing is hurting you. It's hurting them, and they want to make it go away. They're going to give you stupid advice like, Smile! How about you just go for a nice walk? Why don't you just cheer up? Um, they just want it to go away. They don't like it. They don't like it. They do like you. So remember that. They, they love you. They care about you. They want you to be happy. They're not reacting to you. They're reacting to your depression. Now you may find, once your depression is gone, these people just really don't like you. <laughs> it could happen. It could happen. <laughs> Trust me, it's highly unlikely. And if that is the case, if it turns out that you're around people that just don't like you, maybe they just don't like anybody, you can make choices then about what to do about that, and, and you might want to spend less time with them or something. But yeah, it's not you, it's your depression. So, I... And they... Oh, and there's a habitual way you have of dealing with people. So even after I was climbing out of it, I had family members who were still uh, treating me. Maybe they weren't so happy about me because they went, Oh, yeah, sure, you're going to get over it. But they didn't really believe it. So I was very patient with them and I gave them time. Sometimes I had to give them time and distance. But I realized that I wasn't taking it personally anymore. I realize nobody likes depression, and this is just the best they can do, because we're all just doing the best we can. We're all just doing the best we can here. Number 17.